Shows keep watching. Love it when they do it too. The boy need options. Whole team mobbing. Whole team mobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. going on guys it is your man twisted drifter welcome back to another episode here on the channel today we are here with hhrl on r factor 2 and since it is an off week with nascar we are here in the volkswagen fun cup racing the volkswagen beetles guys here on laguna seca should be a fun race hour long so definitely a lot can happen as you guys know, Laguna Seca is not one of my best tracks, but it's also the track that I'm coming up with with, a, with my IMSA series here on the 28th of September. We've got seven people in the race tonight, so it should be a lot of fun. Definitely looking forward to seeing what we can do here. It's been two weeks since I was with these guys. Hopefully you guys can enjoy this. Sit back, relax, have some fun. We are here with Herbie tonight. So now we know it's really late for I'll see you guys when we get to the green flag. Alright guys, pace car is going in. We are coming around turn one for the uh, the final turn here coming to the green flag. Get up there, Jeff. There you go. Green flag is out, guys. Here we go. I do apologize for the gl extreme glare off the racetrack, guys. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Oh, shut. Ooh. All right. A little bit of damage. Let's see what we can do here at Laguna Seca in these Volkswagen Beetles. Have to, but I do like the sound of it. Transmission sounds are nice. Hopefully we can make it around the corkscrew up here. The corkscrew is my biggest issue at this track. Come on, whoa, and there goes, there goes the Richard Petty car, not sure who's driving that, but there he goes. Oh god, we got the, uh, we had the mystery machine, trying to pass us. Whoa, 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 hold it steady. Hang on, John. Oh, come on. Get her out of the grass, back on the track. Clean her entry. Ah. Finally, one lap done. At this nightmare of a track. Let's see. Beetle, I have to admit, guys, is a lot more fun than I thought it would be. Definitely a challenge to drive. I mean, these things you would not think it would be here. Too, too, too hard, but they are tougher than you guys would think. Definitely a lot of fun. Now, guys, on the um, American stock car front, I do want to say I will not be doing any more videos with them due to some dis personal disagreements. I have opted to leave the league, so not going to be racing with them anymore. Not going to be affiliated with them anymore, so... Do apologize for those who are getting in who wanted to see more Xfinity races. That's not going to happen. I do apologize again. Might try and find another sim that has the Xfinity series, but it's not going to be happening with American Stock Car. So, do apologize, guys, but we will see what happens in the future with that uh, situation. Whoa, 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 we lost her. Uh, 
Spots don't matter, it's all about how many laps you can complete with this race tonight. Come on, Herbie, kick her into gear. But yeah, guys, I do regret to inform you of that. I mean, as I said, we will see what happens, though. I'm not too down about it. I had my own flaws and it's just on me. I, I was having issues with keeping things going and keeping out of people so I decided to leave due to some personal disagreements and the fact that I just uh, could not drive well there. So I mean, did have a blast with those guys. I want to thank them for giving me a chance to race with them and just that's all I'm going to say guys. So, I mean, it is what it is. But now back to tonight's so race. Definitely, a, these Beatles are definitely a lot of fun. I mean, corkscrew is a nightmare with any car with, at this track. So, I mean, it's not that big, much different here. Have that issue uh, on the in the Ford GT on Ford of six as well. Also, guys, expect later this week Ford of seven news to be coming out. So, I will be getting another Forza 7 uh, update video coming out to you guys soon. Hopefully you guys are looking forward to that. The demo has been rumored to be around September 18th. Not sure if the sources I heard that from are legit or not, but I heard, that's why I've just heard. And we just spun her again. Right back into this going again. Just pulled a uh, NASCAR move from... Road America race right there. Spin her out, but keep on going. Now, if only it was for the win. <laughs> Not sure if you guys saw that, but I will uh, overlay a clip of that uh, incident there in the uh, video. So. There you go, there you go guys, you just saw what I was talking about right there. But definitely a lot of fun right here. Let's see if we can go and catch up to some people. Someone just had a lag spike. Let's see if I can catch back up to these guys up there. Definitely hard to see the track at the moment with all the glare. I'm gonna have to mess with my settings a little bit to fix this. Uh, not sure what's going on with it. Not sure if it's the tr fact that the track is not maybe not up to DX11 yet, or something with my settings, or I'm just not sure. I will be working with that to try and fix that, guys. So do not worry. I swear this corkscrew wants to kill me. Corkscrew is very difficult right there. Huh. Got it back. Tires are wearing pretty decently. Not sure how many laps we've ran. Got 21 laps on fuel left. So, should 
should be doing pretty good. Come on. At least we're still on the lead lap, that's what matters. Turn on that. Come on, Herbie, come on. Definitely a fun race, guys. I mean, we may not be close to anyone, but just driving this car on this track. Oh, okay. Definitely a lot of fun. Got a big, nice battle going on here with Herky. So. On your tail, Herky. Are, are very nice. Oh god, keep off the wall. He hit, he, he had an incident too, but he didn't spin. I don't think. Whew. Very tricky to when these things want oversteer. The oversteer steer is real, guys. I swear it is definitely real, and it is very difficult. Not tell you how difficult this oversteer is. And that turn always wants to get me. If you guys have any tips for taking that corkscrew at Laguna Seca, let me know. Those would be greatly appreciated. And I just... It would help me out probably in Forza as well as here, guys. So if you have any tips for that corkscrew, let me know. I would greatly appreciate it. Also, if we can get some things working, guys, I do have a surprise game coming to the channel here shortly. It's an old game, but it is full of surprises with what I've just found. That, you can expect that video with me and King Andrew for that video, guys. Now, an update on some, the reason why I haven't been doing videos lately is that there's just a, a lot going on in my personal life at the moment, guys. So, that is why there have not been too many uh, videos going out lately. Uh, a lot of family issues going on, so... That's why there hasn't been many issues going, or uh, videos going out lately. I am trying to get back to where I can get more videos out to you guys and just deal with that. But, just a lot of family stuff going on. So I do apologize for that, guys. Beetles are tough and very difficult to handle if you do not uh, watch what you are doing. I'm going to try taking this in third here. Maybe not spin out as much. Yeah, third seems to be the magic gear. I think we're going to go and pit this lap though. Maybe. Maybe not. Yeah, we're gonna pit the snap, guys. No pit road speed, which is a good thing. 133 pitting.
Might be in, should be in here for I think about 20 seconds is what I've heard guys so Oh, we're in here. Let's get a good look around at the interior of this thing. Not too bad. Track quality is decent. So, should be out of here any moment now. No pit speed, so I can just speed out. Here we go. Pit a bit early there. 133 exit pits. Of course, we are number 53 guys, but everyone knows me as 133. Okay, I guess there is a, sp a speed on pit road. Okay, guys, there is a pit road speeding penalty, I just found out. So, warning when going down pit road, guys. Okay, that was unexpected. Uh, according to what we were told in the driver's meeting, there was no speed, uh, pit speed. But apparently there is. So, a couple, bit of communication and misunderstanding in the rule books for this race and the track settings. So, we'll have to go and work with that. Um, gotta go and get that uh, drive through taken care of. Now, yeah, I could have just been a jerk and not told them, but I think it should be a fair race, and I don't want to just win it by cheating, so I'm going to let them know that there is a, uh, that, that's why I let them know that there was a pit road speed penalty, guys. So we're going to go and serve our drive through this time. Our speed limiter and just serve this drive through here. Gone, guys. We are all set. Let's take the golf course route and uh, head back out. Of course, we still have a little bit of damage. Not gonna worry about that. It's not seeming to uh, damp uh, put a damper on our performance. So. Fuel should be good for about uh, 24 yeah. laps. Well, that was a tricky one, wasn't it? Excuse me, Joyner. Travis Joyner did win our first practice race at this track tonight, guys. So huge congratulations to Travis Joyner for that. Should have kept it in third, should not have gone to second like we did. Uh, need to remember to keep it in third going through there or else we are going to spin. Uh, full course yellow, probably due to me. It looks like it is. That caused the yellow? In the, in the dirt? I'm not sure if it was caused by you or if it was caused by me and my spin. Where'd you spin? Uh, Off the track or on the track? Just before, uh, just before the final turn. Uh, no. Went in the dirt. It was probably my spin. Alright uh, guys, so we are under yellow. Not sure how long we will be here. 
but uh, we are going to return when we get out of this, guys. Alright, uh, guys, so the cautions are glitching here at this track, so we are just going to uh, go green flag racing here. So here we are, guys, back to green flag racing, even though it says one to go, it is glitching big time. So ignore any penalties or anything that happens, and we are just racing this thing. Whatever happens, happens. That was 10 minutes under caution, guys, so that's, that is why we are just going to do this. Here we go. Whoa, whoa! Somebody wanted my back quarter. Travis Joyner. Whew, okay. Hey, whoa, okay, John. All right, or JJ, okay. Oh, JJ spins. This car is getting some beating and banging here. That's why they call it the Beetle Fun Cup. Oh, okay. Oh. Keeper, keeper. See, can we somehow come back and win this? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. And that is a massive spin there. Knew that was eventually going to happen, but my god. Come on, car, get under control. Yep. See if we can go and get caught up some to these people and maybe make some passes. God love the sound of this Volkswagen Beetle mod though guys. If you guys want this, I link to this mod. We'll be in the description box down below. These mods, these beetles are a lot of fun. Definitely having a blast with these things. Getting buggy with the beetles. Now, sadly, we are forced to the cockpit view for these guys, so as I said earlier, should mention that earlier, but I mean, I would love to show you guys the paint job and the rest of this car. Probably will after we get back to the uh, main screen with these things, guys, so let you guys see what it is. banged all over the place. Oh my god, it's going into a wall. We cannot steer. We are all over the place here. Just doing donuts in the sand here. Son of a shite, this beetle is insane. Not having too much luck here with this thing. Oh my god. So the pace car went in, but we never went green. I'm not sure what's going on with that. Looks like the uh, race wanted to pull a twist itself. So that is very interesting to see. A 
Let's see what we can do here for the rest of this race. I know we've had some issues, but maybe we can make some miraculous comeback. I doubt it, but I mean, we'll see what we can do. That corkscrew, if it wasn't for that corkscrew, we wouldn't be having all these issues. Looks like Herky is slowing down for some reason. Not sure what's going on with him. Gonna go and pass him though. Again, again, these beetles do not like me. These beetles just do not like me. Stuck in neutral again. Shut. Uh, I hate these beetles. Absolutely hate these beetles. Oh my god, these beetles are insane. Almost lost her. Again, and if we can do it without having any issues again, I will be happy. We can just do this without issues. <sighs> Thank God. We're probably gonna go in and pit guys these tires again for the water, making it difficult to control this thing. Next lap, we'll pit. I think we've got about 13 minutes left in this race. Maybe a little less, maybe a little more. Let me go and check. 15, yeah, it looks like about 13 minutes. Maybe that says 15, I cannot tell. It's glitching a bit on my screen where, like, the number is... Yeah, it looks like 15 on mine. So, about 15 more minutes left in this race, guys. Call us the Beetle Fun Cup. These things, as I said, are fun, but they are not fun when you can't keep them under control. That is the main thing. So, hopefully we can go and make this thing stay a little more under control and have some less, a, li a little fewer issues and less twisted. But I don't see it happening. I don't see us coming back with a win here. Especially now if we keep having these issues 
definitely need to get these tires changed, guys. We have no grip at all, so we're headed to the pits. Car just stalled on us. And we are about to be lapped. So going into the pits to get these things changed. Luckily our pit stall is right up front, guys. Oh my god. Watch as those guys go by. Uh, not the type of race I wanted to have tonight. I was hoping to go and make up for the straight night that I had a couple weeks ago and a couple nights ago. So, not doing too well. Uh, road courses have never really been my specialty, but I decided to do this just for fun. Plus, it's a track that I need to practice on for for tomorrow's what six is IMSA series. So, I mean. We may, not, we may not be coming out with a win tonight, we may not be coming out with the most laps, but it's definitely a lot of fun just driving these Beatles and having a challenge track like this. As you guys can see with the grippy better tires we are able to get a little more. Now I know you guys were seeing it saying rain there. Well there's no way to change that. It is stuck on the rain tires. We have no option. Uh, things are definitely a challenge. Guys, these may be fun, but they are also definitely, definitely the hardest vehicles I've ever driven in any game, any sim whatsoever. As I said earlier, guys, tomorrow is the uh, Forza Motorsport 7 massive car, final car reveal, and maybe a announcement of a demo, and maybe we'll know if official news about when the demo is coming out tomorrow, guys. No, not sure yet, but we will. But tune in to Twisted Drifter Gaming, and you will be the first to know about what is going to be happening with that demo. When it's announced, I will be getting that video out immediately. Then you guys know what is going on with the demo, when it's coming out, and when and how you can expect to download that, guys. And whatever else info is released about that, you can expect to see that info here first on Twisted Drifter Gaming, guys. Ten minutes left in the race. That cloak screw hates me. This is by far the hardest car, hardest track combination I've ever had. Is there a yellow flag or something? What's going on? I don't think so. 
Mine says please care check the bandit in the left lane. I don't know what's going on. It's been like that for a while now. It's been like that all the race. Yeah, we just went green. It's just there. I got one too. Yeah, as, I, as I've said, these are. Yeah. These are hard car, but they're a lot of fun. Thank you for picking them, Greg. They are fun. That was tough trying to recover that one. Almost had her spun. Luckily we were able to recover. Can't believe we kept her there. I'm just curious exactly how fast we are going with these things. Hold on guys. Right here, there we go. Turn that on and see exactly how fast we are going with this. Here we go, come on, left turn. Ooh, do not lose her. I know I've not been too talkative to, to this video, guys. I'm just trying to focus, and it's not easy to focus and talk at the same time on this track, so do apologize. As you guys have seen, these vehicles are not easy to drive. Like Brent is safe, guys. Again, I do want to go and say, um, I do want to go and say that I hope everybody in uh, Houston is all right. Everybody who is down in Texas is okay. I do want to let you all know if you have family in there that, that the people down there are in my prayers at the moment, down where they are affected by that hurricane. I know that it is back at sea, but is expected to make landfall again. There's another tropical storm that's supposed to hit Louisiana all the people and that area. So all the people that are in the path of that storm are also in my prayers, guys. So I will be praying for those people as I don't I don't want to see anyone hurt from those storms, but I know that people are getting hurt and losing their homes and I they are in my prayers. Hope that they can uh stay safe and uh just have this, just keep their lives and families together. <sighs> now, I mean, now guys, I do want to go and talk about some stuff with Jusha Shikai. I know that uh, Jusha Shikai has had some issues lately, and I know that we've been talking about updates for a while, but there were some issues with um, licensing. And some cars that were supposed to be coming out into the game. Apparently, the uh, developer that for the game found out that those models were stolen uh, by the person that he bought them from. 
so he has taken the proper the proper um, procedures and not uploaded the game's update. Told Steam to pull that update out and um, also contacted Unity and reported that guy for stealing the models. The next, so what is going to happen, guys? Is within the next few days to a week or whatever. Um, expect Yushu Shinkai to be updated without those cars, but with modding, guys. So we have, we will soon be able to mod Yushu Shinkai and be using creator content. So once we can get some creator content into the game, expect some videos on that. I know we've got a Shelby coming in so far, a Twingo, which I know a lot of people on the Discord want to see. So I will be trying to get that Twingo out in a video, guys. And another thing I will be trying to get out there will be some of the tracks. And just sliding those cars in there, guys. Juice Sky has an amazing physics system, amazing customization. And, and I mean, the developer wanted to get this stuff out there, but he came across some bugs in the middle of trying to get the update out, which caused some issues with the game and made the and have to rework a bunch of stuff. Which then just delayed the update even more. So it's not that he was that he's abandoned us, guys. He has not abandoned the community. He's just got a lot of stuff going on right now with the uh, game having bugs. Going up on you, Robert. I see you, Travis. Guys, yeah, you're on the inside. With the game having some bugs, the uh, update um, having cars that were no problem that were unfinished and stolen, and just a bunch of other stuff, guys. So that is why we have not um, seen an update since May. But an update will be coming soon with a bunch of modding features coming available. Not sure on multiplayer yet, but I think he mainly wants to go and focus more on just keeping the game alive right now while he tries and uh, get stuff fixed. So... Yeah. Hopefully you guys are looking forward to that. sure what's going to happen with that game I mean I know I, I know I want to get some more footage out on it I know it's got updates and with the modding but just right now I mean there's so much stuff going on and I mean hopefully we can get some decent mods with it I have faith in the developer I have faith in the game but I haven't been on that game in a while so I mean may try and get back on to it once the uh, Patches out. We've got one minute left in this race, guys. Hopefully, we can get finish this lap. I know we've sucked this race pretty much, but I mean, had a lot of fun driving these things and just trying to see what we can do. So next week we should have back to the NASCAR schedule, guys. I will be recording that with the uh, stock cars. I'm not sure where we'll be racing at exactly, but. We'll be recording that. I think it might be Darlington. I'm not exactly sure though. So expect to see that recorded, guys, for the channel. Hopefully, I can go and get that recorded for you guys. I know it will be a lot of fun. As I said, it should be Darlington. Not exactly sure, but if it is, it will be a very difficult race. Very fun race. We got a battle going on behind us. Point, and that uh, was over. Thank you. <laughs> it told me 18 laps deducted. <laughs> 16 laps deducted. That was fun, Greg. <laughs> Very good. That was a lot of fun. That was wild. Thank you, Greg. Alright, well, guys, that will end it for the uh, video. Um, looks like I did. Greg won. Finally, you won. What is your result?
had a lot of fun. So I mean, huge I thank you to. I crossed the Stroke finish line ahead of you. <laughs> huge thank oh, you to Greg for this, this race, guys. I'm coming, John. Good win, so JJ. I think. I, can, right? I can adjust the standings when I get in. Sound muted. Ah, uh, guys, that is going to end it though. If you guys did enjoy today's video, be sure to leave a like, comment down below if you want to see more R Factor 2, guys. Um, let's go and uh, hop in here and look at the car real quick. I know I promised you guys that we would be able to look at this. So, here it is, guys. The Beetle that we were racing in. I know it's got a couple bump scrapes, but that is the Beetle that we were racing, guys. Had a lot of fun racing with Herbie tonight. Definitely, I mean, I, definitely a hell of a car to drive a very difficult one very technical track and i just had a lot of fun so huge thank you to greg for the opportunity to race this ivan just had to go and bump me as he was coming into his pits <laughs> but definitely a lot of fun hopefully you guys did enjoy always remember mental health does matter don't be afraid to speak if you have issues guys it is okay to talk about them also guys remember that it is okay to seek help if you need help please be sure to seek it and always remember that your mental health label does not define you. You are who you choose to be. You can do whatever you need to do in life, guys. Until next time, it is your man Twisted Drifter. I will see you guys in the next video. I'm out.